Well, it's an emergency mini Vino. Well, it's more of a lunchtime Vino. It's Thursday the 20th of July 2017. Three minutes to 11. I just had the double glazing repaired, various bits and pieces. Now off to the Malcolm Uphill for hashtag Curry Thursday. Not raining. However, tomorrow, when I'm on MB08 in Hereford, it's going to hammer down. So, and there we go. Let's go. Well, okay, this is cider spelt with a Y. And Sonia behind the bar said, that's better cider because it's spelt with a Y. And I wasn't sure, so I looked it up. And general consensus, if it's spelled with a Y, it's from a craft producer. This is from Paul Goon, Cornish Apple Cider 5%. And so far, this is the best cider I've had. As you can see, uh, not exactly effervescent, but it's out of a box. Huge apple taste, medium, 5% alcohol by volume, and a B++. I really like it. Mr. Manning. It's got a little bit of bitterness, a little bit of sweetness, nice variety, huge apple taste, and as you can tell, it's Curry Thursday. Okay, the curry's on order, and I met an old friend, he's actually working up here. Um, Matt Goose by Purity, beers, brewing, ales, whatever, 4.2% alcohol by volume. Usually have it in bottles, some draft. There are barges coming, and there's our condiments. There's our carpet, Mr. Manning. The award win winning Mr. Manning. Who the thought? What a hero! Mr. Manning in charge of planning. Ooh! Oh, that's good. I don't know. B++, I'm liking that, that's really doing it, yeah B++, from Oakham Ales, this is Bishop's Farewell, and I am stuffed, it's 4.6% alcohol by volume, I'm saying naturally cloudy, we do tend to like Oakham Ales because it tends to be hoppy, and it smells hoppy, there's a touch of citrus in there. Mm hmm Sharp. I'm getting a lot of grapefruit in here. Sharp and grapefruit. Deep less in a bit. I think that's going to help. Current dark skies is a possibility of light rain for the next hour. So far, we are surviving.